Hey, how's it going, everybody? Cheers. Recently, I posted on my Facebook that I <laughs> I went to a brewery down in Berwick, Nova Scotia, and I picked up ten different selections. Ten of them. Count them. Ten of them. <laughs> and seeing as how this is the last of the ten of them, I thought I would review it and record it. Big boy. Kickstarter double IPA, 9% alcohol, L A B V U and 120 IBUs. Woo! Sounds pretty hefty, eh? Sounds pretty hefty. Let me give you a quick read on the can here. It's not very long. <clears throat> a heavily hopped double IPA with enormous amounts of North American hops and a good dose of local honey. This double IPA is a surprisingly smooth and well balanced with a nice juicy hop profile. All right, we're gonna give this a go. Holy crap, it's July 18th, 2021. God knows when this will be posted, but I try, I'll try to post it as quick as I can, but let's pour this one up. I'm already half, uh, I'm already half smashed. <laughs> but anyways, I'm gonna pour this one up, have a little go at it in my Smokehouse Nano Brewery glass that I picked up. Nice. All right, give it a sniffy. Doesn't have much of an aroma, so let's just go right to the taste. <laughs> Cheers. Hey, hey, whoa, woohoo! Yeah, well, that's very nice. Oh, first off, yeah, I mean, I can tell it's. I can definitely tell it's it's mighty or hefty or beefy, whatever you want to say it. Chunky, I don't know. It's good. It's nice. It's got that it's got that uh, big heavy grain and hop alcohol thing going on. Wow. Hey, that is balanced quite nice. They mentioned a balance. I'm not sure if I can taste the honey. The honey is really, really hard to pick up in a beer, I've always found. But um, it is quite balanced, actually, quite nice. Hops are good. The malt, malt and grains are nice. Very nice. Look at that dark color. It's like a that's a very nice dark amber color. Very nice, eh? Very nice. Boy, I'm going to need something to eat after this. Something that soaks up a lot of booze. <laughs> yeah, sure, why not, right? You know, I got hamburgers in the fridge, why not, right? I ain't got no pecoroni. I wasn't going to review the whole damn ten of them, but from the Nano Brewery here in, in uh, the Smokehouse Nano Brewery here in Nova Scotia, Berwick, Nova Scotia, um, some of the better this is number 10 of the of all the ones I've had and and crazy enough being a nano brewery they actually had at least one more that I didn't buy <laughs> they had at least 11 selections so that's pretty good for a nano brewery and this is one of the better beers of the 10 the other two beers that I really enjoyed this one was nice too uh, one here called punch Hill Porter was really nice the brown ale was really nice and I just had the ZZ Hop and, uh, earlier tonight, and that was pretty nice too. Those were some of the better ones of the selections they had to offer. But uh, as far as this one's concerned, this is uh, 8.5 out of 10, I guess. It's very nice. Not only is it hoppy, but malty, but it's actually balanced and smooth. Cheers, keep your mugs full, we'll see you again real soon.